on Darnitishan Lithalin. We're back from our Dragon Age. Let's see. Gotta crack my do. Uh, we're in Orzmar, the Dwarven City. The king died uh, shortly ago. And there is a fight over who gets to take over between his son and his most trusted advisor. His son is kind of a dickhead, but he wants Orzammar to kind of break away from its tradition-minded, uh, you know, way of running things and move a little forward into the future with the rest of the species above ground while Lord Harrowmont wants to keep things kind of as they are but he's a nice dude. Uh, I think on this playthrough we're siding with uh, Balin, the son. Uh, we've picked up a couple smaller quests around here which we'll try and finish and our goal is also to get into the deep roads. Uh, we had no deaths, no more taints last time. Still got a nice 2 to 1 ratio there. I like the pretty numbers. Uh, let's get back to the game. Oh, where did we leave off? Oh yeah, we we're exploring the palace. Who has a level up? Did I do the- yeah, I did little ups. Okay. Right, we met Dagna, who wants to study at the Circle of Magi, even though dwarves can't perform magics. He still feels it would be an important cultural exchange for uh, her to study magic and share some of the dwarves' uh, techniques and stuff for working with Lyrium, which a lot of mages in the Circle rely on. Uh, right. The dude wants to open a chantry. We can tell him that that's been approved. Um, we met a girl in the library who was looking for records to prove her family is descended from one of the, um, uh, paragons, which would mean that she would be a noble. And then we have stuff from Haramont and Balin to pick a side. And Balin just wants us to show these promissory notes to Lady Dace and Lord Helmy to say that Haramont's uh, trying to trick him on some land sales. Which is probably false, but you know what? That's their business. We just need someone to be on the throne so we can get their help to fight the Darkspawn. All right. ah. So earlier today, uh, we had we went into town for our uh, eye exam, like checkup. Um, wait, which way is out? Yeah. That And even though it's supposed to be an annual eye exam, uh... Wait, that's a shame bear thing. God damn it, where are we going? Oh, even though it's supposed to be an annual exi exam... The Legion of the Dead Warriors secretly wear Prince Balin's colors. Our prince has Orzammar's deadliest warriors behind him. Yeah, interesting. What do you want? Ah, oh, I suppose you're the Grey Warden everyone's talking about. Uh, yes, I am Uthanera. It's fascinating the surface has an entire order dedicated to fighting Darkspawn. Down here, that's just what fighting means. But I'm sure it's more difficult on the surface. It must be much harder to find them. Uh, not really. Are you Lady Dace? I am. 
And what business would you have with me? Uh, you might want to look at these papers. Well, this isn't exactly a surface broadsheet. Where did you get these? Never mind. It is true enough, but there's nothing I can do about it. This deal was made on behalf of our entire house. Only my father can revoke it. Uh, politics. Well, will you tell him? I cannot. Not for weeks. What? He is leading a deep roads expedition, God trying to secure an ancient it. taig. It's unlikely he'll be back before the election, but perhaps this vote is important enough for you to brave the tunnels to tell him? The Dace family would be in your debt. <sighs> How would I know where to find your father? He was searching an old Iduken site. He left me with this map, in case his expedition never returned. I'll give you a pass as well. Usually, no one is allowed past yes. the front lines. Does that mean you'll go? Yes, I'll leave right now. So Balin's victory means enough for you to risk your life. How interesting. Well... Alright, so we gotta find Anmar Dace in the Deep Roads. And meanwhile, over here... Uh, we saw Lord Helmy. Where did we see Lord Helmy? I wonder if he was outside or he was in the tavern. I think he might have been in the tavern. Well, let's go find out. Uh, but yeah, so it's supposed to be an annual ex eye exam, but uh, you know, for whatever reason. Balin promises radical changes that will offend the ancient paragons. Have our traditions no value? Uh, for whatever reason, we didn't Two get around to it tomorrow. To this year. By all the holy it's sodding ancestors, how belong? can you people just ignore that? Bronca didn't go alone, Ogren. She took the whole house, everybody but you. So just get over to Tapsters and drown yourself already. You know as well as I do, that's how this always ends. You think I'm afraid of some cub warrior who's barely off the teach? <laughs> I'll... You lift a weapon or attack a single citizen in Orzammar, and you're stripped of your caste and exiled. Even you can't have forgotten that. Get out of here before I call a guardsman. Huh, looking for Bronca. So he's going to Tapsters too. So it's supposed to be an annual exam. We didn't get around to it until now two years um for whatever reason but uh we got there and the cute tech who i surely have a crush on so um, I've been hearing god damn stop a talking wine merchant is falling behind on his payments i i can't imagine what you mean i, I paid my expenses but she both what remembered me from two years ago and also still had the little note i gave her and that's made it's me very happy, and sure I've kind of been floating on a cloud all day. That no one decides to just burn everything in your store. My store! Please, I don't have much. Business isn't good. People are scared. Tell Jarvie I'll get her money. I... Jarvie is not happy with your promises, old man. Now let's go inside and see what you've been holding back. Hmm. Someone's being hit up for protection money. Maybe the protectors should pay protection money against me. This is all I have right now. I could get more if I sell something. Well, well. Looks like we have a visitor. Friend of yours? Is there a problem here, friend? Are these men threatening you? Please! Don't get involved with this. You don't know what they're like. Then allow no, me tight. to make some introductions. These are dangerous times in Orzammar, stranger. Lucky us, the merciful Jarvia is offering protection from the chaos. You're wearing some fancy stuff there. Might make you a target. So if you want the Carter's guarantee of safety, it's yours for the reasonable price of ten gold sovereigns. Or I can't say what might happen. <laughs> T 
take a good look. Do you really want to start this? Whoa, whoa. All right, you win. I'm not gonna die for ten lousy sovereigns. Look how big this man behind me is. Look how big my dog is. You really want to fuck with us? Also, sorry if I crunch on mic. I am eating egg salad by way of uh, black bean tortilla chips. Which is delicious, but crunchy. Ancestors, bless you for saving my poor store. I don't know how to express my gratitude. What do you know about this Jarvia? I... I've never met her, of course. They say she never leaves Dust Town. That's uh, the older area of the city where the castless congregate. She's the one directing this depravity. Since good King Endrin died, they're getting bolder. They used to be a problem only in Dust Town, but now they're in the commons, shaking honest men down for coin. What do you know about her Carta? A band of castless thugs. They're to blame for all the crime in Orzammar these days. They're criminals, and the children of criminals. The ancestors themselves declared them irredeemable. Hmm. The cast divide is deep indeed. These castless, they're all the same. Beggars, thugs, and murderers, everyone. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm grateful for your help, but I don't think we have any more to talk about. Sorry, I'm crunching. All right. All oh, right, and also while we were in the shape room, someone stole something, and it was probably a a bald castless guy who's probably in the tavern. It's Dagna. The lady lost her son on an expedition, so we can look for him while we're down there too. So much to do in the deep roads. Yes, tell me. I wasn't expecting you back. I guess you realize this is about the only fun in Orzammar? Um... Do you know anything about this Carta? The Assembly passed laws prohibiting the castless from holding any job a legitimate citizen can do. Of course they turn to crime. What else can they do? Huh? I have news. Carl Mark is double dealing you in Lady Days. Oh, well, I'd ask for proof or why you care, but frankly, I'm so tired of it I'm not even surprised anymore. I don't even want the land, but my house would kill me if I turned it down. Responsibilities, you know. Now I'll have to go through the whole process of rejecting the deal. And we'll both have to try something else. And I thought it was going to be a nice day. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news. You're just doing what you think is right. I'll have to inform Mother that Lord Harrowmont hasn't bought our vote after all. Man, these black bean chips are really good. Oh, you're here too. What do you want? Hey, I heard about you. Grey Warden, coming from the surface. Great crisis in the world. Someone saw you talking to Vartag Gavorn, and now it's all over that you've been doing dirty errands for Balin. I figured you'd be the one, you know, who could help me find Branca. But I guess you're just like all the rest. All the rest of whom? Power-hungry Deep Lords. The only real concern they have is whose ass gets the throne. You don't have to play dumb, Warden. Their lackeys only come to me when they want something. Well, if you want the secrets of a paragon, do the work and find her. Is that who Branca, Branca is? She's the paragon? City's only living paragon, and she's been lost in the deep roads for two years. Two years, and no one's raised a bleeding army to go look for her. Why do you care, huh? You looking to uncover all her secrets? Is that what Balin wants? 
I know he's been poking around, trying to find things out about her, what she was looking for. Won't tell me spit, though. He wants it for himself, right? A little blessing from the Ancients' technology, and he's assured the throne. Is that it? Uh, what are you talking about? What technology? You are looking for it. Of course, that's all anyone cares about. Well, sawed off and sawed your mother, too. I need a bleeding drink. You keep on your errands. Until your boss really commits to looking, you're getting nothing but smoke out of old Ogren. Uh, okay. Sawed off, Duster. Bye. Alright, I'm gonna find a bald man. Be bald. No, my hair. You're kind of bald. A lot of deep roads excursions these days. I wonder what everyone. Did you need something else, Warden? I'm looking for someone. I? Maybe I can help. Oh. Thought Agra might be here. He should be by the trash barrel. Easy to spot. Everyone gives him a wide berth. Thank you kindly. Oh no, they said the bald guy who stole the shepherd stuff was down in the... Down, down there. Dust town. Hey, you can have your permit. Andraste teaches that patience is the child of wisdom, but I'm eager to hear if you've seen the Shaper. Ah, uh, he agreed to let you hold prayer meetings. Oh, praise the Maker! You truly walk in the light, friend. I already found a convert among the merchants who offered his shop as a temporary chantry. It's just by the tapsters. Please, come to our first service. Uh, no thanks. Also, keep your eye out for any loose nugs. Should be more about. We already got jumped down here. Hey, you. What do you want, Warden? You're out of your element down here. I'm looking for a thief who dared steal from the Shaperet. Is that so? What makes you think anyone here would turn me, I mean, this person in? Uh huh. You've walked into a sodding fight, Warden, and I've yeah. already passed your stupid tome along. Too bad for you. Oh. Oh, you're a roguey too, huh? Well, let's blind you. And we'll help you in the nards. Stab you. Oh, you're already dead. Very well. Proving receipt. A losing betting receipt crumbled in anchor. These are only printed in the proving grounds. Boy. Well, looks like we gotta go to the proving grounds anyway. Nug. There are many great tales of lost kings who return to their lands to reign in glory. I am not lost, nor for <laughs> that matter a king. And there's nothing glorious about me. You are Merrick's son. You are the rightful king of Ferelden. I am the son of a starstruck maid and an indiscreet man who just happened to be king. <sighs> Look, I can't be king. Some days I have trouble figuring out which boot goes on which foot. Yes, but complete fools are made leaders of kingdoms. I'm all going to the make time. you king because and you're otherwise. Not a fool. What an utter relief. Uh, and don't so. worry about the boots. Kings don't need to dress themselves. That's what advisors are for, isn't it? And starstruck maids, apparently. Look.
it's like a different room. I uh, thought their warriors at least would be bigger. <laughs> Stan! Watch for Pio Naidukin. He's won the squad combat four years running. He has 11 decapitations so far. He needs just three more for the one season record. Damn. I guess you've watched a lot of provings then. Front row seats at every grand proving since my father took me on his shoulders. Name's Varek. I got a controlling interest in a mine off the old Rustin Tig. But my backers know not to hand me a pick any day there's blood on the stone, if you know what I mean. <laughs> what are the rules? They change from round to round. Sometimes it's bare hands, sometimes weapons, sometimes pairs or squads. It's announced when the fight begins. That's about all the warning anyone gets. So the proving's just a tournament? Sure. Like King Endrin was just a noble. A proving is a sacred art. Any dispute brought to the proving round is settled by the ancestor's decision. And no one can protest it. Have you ever fought in one? Me? Are you out of your mind? I'm a miner, not a warrior. Cool. Isn't that nice? Now, if you'll just excuse me. I'm telling you, Piotin will take the prize. You can put gold on it. Hmm. Good to know. Wild laughter in the background. Hey. Good day, stranger. Welcome to the Proving Arena. We're still closed until the fighters make their preparations, but come back this afternoon if you want to watch the show. Uh, sounds like fun. I'll come back then. Okay. So Enjoy our talking. grand city. Who talks about making bets? If you're looking for seats, speak with a guardsman. Can you believe how many families are supporting Balin? Bunch of fans. Alright, there's a wall carving over this way, so I'm gonna go through this door. SP. Private area, combatants only. Yeah, yeah. What about here? A metal door. Hello. Guards, remove this intruder. Do not disturb me. I must meditate before my fight. Sure. Sorry, I was just leaving. Okay, bye. Hi. Fine to see you here, Warden. A number of people have told me they hope to see you in the Provings. Oh, it's I'm a rare opportunity to fight against someone so exotically trained. In fact, a few were hoping you'd take part in some informal action. Oh, here we go. Um, I'm game. What do you have in mind? Say the word and I'll line up a team from one of the younger houses. They don't often get a chance to test themselves in the provings. They're a hungry bunch who employ unusual tactics. Understand that there's no concern for fairness here. Your battles will be hard won. Uh, I'll come back for some action later. I'll be here. Cool. Uh, yeah. Who bought or who won that stinking book? Get out of here! No. 
You looking at something? Not really. Hi. Uh, greetings. I'm Uthanera of the Grey Wardens. Don't take it personally. Hanashan's a member of the Silent Sisters. She doesn't talk to anyone. Oh, okay. Uh, what are the Silent Sisters? They're an order of female warriors founded by Astith the Grey, a woman of the warrior caste who first fought for women's right to be soldiers. When no one listened to her words, Astith cut out her tongue and dedicated herself to training until she won a grand proving barehanded. The women who joined her order cut out their tongues in her honor. Uh, who are, who are you? I am Ferindin. I serve as Hanashan's trainer and translator. As a silent sister, Hanashan cut out her tongue like the ancient paragon, Astith the Grey. As you might imagine, she requires my services for more mundane tasks. Yeah, I should get going. Ancestors guide you. Wah! Cool. Um, hi. Hello. I'm here about uh, a book that she has Point. one slash. This is a waste of That's a good shot. Hey, hey you. The dog's gonna get you. Handled. Good job, everybody. There we go. A volume of Shaper History. Let's take that where it's supposed to be. I'm the librarian. I've come to collect. something witty. Come to collect the fine. I'm the librarian, and you're overdue. If only we could kill people who kept books too long. You sing a great deal. Yes, I do. Music lifts my spirit. Would you like me to stop? I didn't say that. Was that part of your chant? <laughs> no. It was a ballad about a highwayman and the tavern girl who loved him. Could you not tell? All your language sounds the same to me. I thought you were <laughs> singing of vegetables, actually. <laughs> Uh, no, Shepard is upstairs. And we have a nug to deliver. Nugs, nugs, nugs. You're the best wrangler I've ever seen. But there's more out there. There's more? Where haven't we gone yet? As you say. Are there nugs in the deep roads? Deep nugs. Could the end of Orzammar be nigh? Turn to Lord Harrowmont and assure the future of. Lord Harrowmont <laughs> said to have kicked Castless in the street. <laughs> Favorite? No, your team is yeah. Smashes the doors open. I have your book. Here you go. You found it. Warden, you have my gratitude. You're a bright spot in an otherwise dark time. Thank you. Alright. 
Anything else we can do in town? Uh, that's in the deep roads. That's in the deep roads. That's in the deep roads. And that's in the circle. Alright. Let's head down deep. Because now we have a special pass. A new offensive is required against the Darkspawn, says Lord Maven. No, the Darkspawn are busy upstairs. Grey Warden arrives in Orzammar, undoubtedly to offer assistance to Lord Harrowmont. <laughs> uh, head titles. Er, head titles? What the fuck is a head title? Headlines. Hey, what's up here? I remember when the Grey Wardens would visit. Oh, the festivities we had. Those days are past, aren't they? I mean, I don't know, man. I still party. Got the nugs down here. Hello. Just can't get enough of our clammy mine air, can you? Did you need something? Um. What do you know about Paragon Bronco? What anyone knows. She went out there with her entire house and she's never coming back. You don't think maybe she's still there, Commander? She is a Paragon, after all. And now she's an ancestor. No one lasts two years in the tunnels. Uh, will you let me pass? Into the deep roads? Not without a full unit of soldiers to back you, my friend. Or a Desher's permission to risk yourself. Orzammar can't afford to lose its citizens or honored guests on casual visits to the deeps. I'm looking for Lord Dace's patrol. I see you have his daughter's seal, so I will not stop you. But be careful. Just because the beasts have pulled back from Ozamar doesn't mean there are any fewer in the deep roads. Either we finally have the edge, which I doubt, or the beasts are building up numbers for the next attack. Actually, they've made their move on the surface. We've had this conversation already. The surface? But I thought the vermin never went up that far except it. Except during blights. Ancestors save us if that's what's happening. I should go. Best of luck. Thanks. Okay, I can just walk past now. Cool. Thanks, P. Oh, that's not. All right, into the hole. All right, that's the reservoir. Oh man, it's a whole underground map out here. Uh, we're gonna head to the Aduken Tig, which is where uh, what's his face was headed. Welcome to the Deep Roads. Man, can you imagine this? They built miles of roads like this. Between various cities and shit. Yeah, I'm fine. Okay. Boy, okay, Stan, get your head out of my way. Oh, there's a whole bunch of you popping up from underground. No, you're the one that does magic. I'm gonna hit you. Yeah. Yeah. 
I'm gonna die. Very well. Job team. Ooh, some desert extract. All right, these are the bombs, right? Yeah, solar bomb and the acid flask. I think I'm just gonna keep this stuff to put on my sword. There. Yeah, I've got a bunch of gifts to give people when we get back. Hopefully this is fact the phone. Um I did put a filter on the stream. Hopefully this is a brighter for you than it is for me. Up a handle and stuff. As you say. Gonna pick up all these goodies. That's the way we came in. Demonic kicker. Icky kicker. Oh, more fun. Alright, that looks like it loops but I'm actually gonna go this way first allow me I can ah! do that for you rude yes I don't think you're higher than I'll I do am. it no nice try oh yep see him over there very well a bag of limbs. Great. That's great. The ritual was very suspic specific, as such things probably should be. Torso, head, and limbs spread amongst the deep roads to prevent the creature from returning. Looks like they died during the cutting, but we can fulfill the last part in their stead. I'm not familiar with the elven ritual, why would I be, but it seems pretty straightforward. Never even saw the thing. Bet a sword would take care of it. Sawed it, and this bag of legs. Oh, maybe uh, we should uh, leave that there. Instead of returning severed body yes. parts together. So that whatever it is can return. Oh, they saw me! It's okay, you guys can handle that real quick. Some kind of trap. Oh, no, don't 
don't don't trigger the trap. Nooks and crannies. Grab all the good. Ooh, deep sucker! They're like compies. They're kind of cute, actually. I love them. Strange beasts. Look at the little bugger. He's got like a leech face. Where there's one, there's just three more. Even any goodies for me? No. Ah, there they are. Very well. Actually, maybe I should. <laughs> <laughs> So I could cover a little bit from the back. No, I'm standing in front. Uh, it sounds like lava. Magma, rather, since we're underground. Ooh, a city. Ah! Somebody's being attacked. You wanna die, yeah. don't you? Oh, we found her dead. One second while I poke around for goodies. Ah! Sneaky! walk over here and look at this sneaky thing over here which I think is XP oh it's another fractured stone of course it's inside frost rock yes ooh ice arrows Yep, done with the fire arrows. And we have the elf lights, so I'm saving those for bigger fish. Then you have a torn jugular. Can't have that. Will be done. Hi, Crystal. All right. Hi. Hello. How are you? You pulled us from a tight spot, friend. You have my gratitude. I am Lord Anwar Dace. 
So how does an elf come to be down here anyway? Um, Lord Harrow, uh, you should look at these papers. I don't understand. What could? These are the terms of a deal Which we made the with Lord Harrowmont, but the charlatan. He's promised the exact same land to hell me. Thank you for bringing this to my attention. I owe you twice now. My life and my house's fortune. Um, I am at your service. May the ancestors smile on you. I must return now. My men need healing and I want to look into this. You wish to travel with us? Uh, no, I'm going to explore further. Be careful then. There are more dangerous things than deep stalkers down here. Like treasure chests. Warren Mace. No! I could do that for you. Definitely gonna have to level up before I come back down here. Dark spawn dagger. Ooh! Poor little life stalkers. Hi. Come gather around me. <laughs> <laughs> Allow me. I could do that for you. Shush you. All right. If that leads out, You battle a canary. Man, I'm going to keep exploring till it tells me hey, I'm going to leave the zone. Little deep stalkers. Oh, there's a lot of you. I tried to be merciful. <laughs> Back up there. Alright, so we'll go this way. Round. These beasts are surely dangerous. Surely. This is a waste of time! 
time! Let's go somewhere. Well, this looks like an ambush spot. Hey, where are you? There you are. Oh, you have a leader. This will not end well. <laughs> I am back. I was here the whole time. Let's call a dagger. Let's call a dagger. Deep mushroom. Parentheses, deep hurting voice. Deep mushroom. So this, I think, loops around and then back up to there, so fill that in on the map and then we can head out. Man, I got a lot of these elemental rocks to sell, since I'm never going to use them to make bones or salves, salves, however you pronounce that word. Wait, this is the end. Oh, it's a cave in. This is. What's this giving me? Penalty to health regeneration. Okay, fine. Just gonna leave it there until we got back to the campfire, but that might be a bit so. Uh huh. Lightning kills Stan. Ooh. Oh shit, fireball. Everybody take a sip. He's dying, that's not good. Oh 
gosh. All right, there's only one of you left. Maybe. Ooh, what the fuck is up with that menu? Uh, uh, okay, we're gonna load last save. Shit. Where did it save? It's gonna auto save when we reach the I do can tag. Alright, so we'll go save the guy and then we'll just leave with them. And then come back and explore later. Unless the game wants to crash, because usually when the menu starts looking like that. Holy shit! In the VODs, this part gets sped up to silly music. him with the emissary you help me with that emissary at your order where am i there i am who knew that our fight tactics tactics Woo, Stan, nice. Very well. Give me your booty. Oh, a large dark spot. Right. Now that we got As our you say. revenge. And we'll do all the inventory shuffling and stuff when we get back to the camp. As you say.
time. Careful. Careful. I don't think that's the last of them. Beasts. Beasts are surely dangerous. Oh. <laughs> of course. <laughs> That's a fast one. Nice arrows. Hello. You pulled us from a tight spot, friend. You have my gratitude. I am Lord Anwar Dace. So how does an elf come to be down here anyway? Uh, you should look at these papers. I don't understand. What could... These are the terms of a deal we made with Lord Haramont, but for the charlatan. He's promised the exact same land to hell me. Thank you for bringing this to my attention. I owe you twice now, my life and my house's fortune. I'm at your service. May the ancestors smile on you. I must return now. My men need healing and I want to look into this. You wish to travel with us? Sure. Safety in numbers, right? And let us reach Orzammar before more beasts find our scent. Hoo! <laughs> yeah, that's still fucked up. Alright. Saving here now. Back in Orzammar. Um Hey, we found your dad. You have house Dace's thanks. You're welcome. Alright. Didn't find evidence of rock. Two birds. I don't know how far into the hill goes. They're in the Orton Taig, which we were not out here at the Idukan Taig. Alright. Tell them I delivered the papers. Chamber of the Assembly. Lord Harrowan. Wow. Did you do that with your voice? Lord Balin's impending marriage to a castless proves his dedication to change. No dwarf is without worth. He has been heard to say. Wait, no. Assembly. Up here. Lady Dace just came through the quarter on a tear. She's telling everyone who'll listen what a leech and a liar Haramont is. Good job. So you were serious about wanting to help us. Are you ready to meet Balin? I am serious about getting someone on the throne to give me people to fight the Darkspawn. I'm ready. Take me to him. I warn you, be on your best behavior and keep your weapons sheathed. But I like gesturing wildly with my daggers while I speak. I am impressed, Warden. Not many outsiders so quickly grasp Orzammar's rather convoluted politics. I am Prince Balin. Fartag told me of your efforts against the usurper who tried to claim my father's throne. Um... All I care about is getting troops to face the Blight. Then we have a common goal. We may not like each other, but the Blight is our first priority. We need absolute unity to fight against the fulcrum of true evil. Then you'll honor your agreement with the Wardens? Absolutely. And sworn on the mail of my ancestors, as soon as Orzammar is united under my rule. Unfortunately, while this debate rages, I have no power to send the troops you need. You've seen for yourself, the city is a slaughterhouse. Criminals run lawless. I could never hold the throne if I allowed such chaos. 
<sighs> How can I help you take the throne? You have struck a blow against Haramont already, and I thank you for that. But there is another faction in play here. Is it the Carta? Have you heard of a woman named yeah. Jarvia and the yeah. Carta of Criminals she runs? The Gang of Castellus, yes. They know Orzammar is divided now and has no time for them. It's made them bold. If I show the city I can eliminate such a threat, well, let's just say my position would be stronger. Uh... Why haven't you been able to take her out before? She is secretive, and is only the current leader of a group that has plagued Orzammar for years. They stay mostly in Dust Town below the city. Only Castless live there. And they are too scared of reprisal to cooperate with guardsmen. And frankly, until my father's death, they only harassed their own kind. Now they attack honest citizens. Yeah, just point me at them and your trouble's over. Your eagerness is charming. If you can do as you say, you will have the troops you need the moment I take the throne. Unfortunately, I have little information on Jarvia. Her base of power is in Dust Town, the lowest part of the city. And my men have few sources there. Maybe the Castless will talk more freely with a stranger. I'll look into it. That's all I can promise. That's all I can ask. But I can be of no help until this problem is solved. And every minute we wait, more Darkspawn swarm into human lands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Who leveled up? Sten leveled up. Need to find a way into Jarvia's hideout. Perhaps you'll be able to find some clues in Dust Town. Alright, we're gonna go talk to Dust Town. We're gonna level up Sten. He has 30 st Wait, we needed him like 34 or something for a hat or something. Um. I usually just give them survival because it gives them a bonus to nature resistance. Huh, a large damage bonus against golems and other constructs. That's funny, that sounds like that might come in handy down in the deep roads if we find that Bronk is still alive and somehow, you know, figuring out how to get the golems and stuff working. Stunning's also good though. No, sure, why not? Can I get to the camp from here? Uh, nope, we're underground. The prince appreciates your service. The prince appreciates your yeah, service. Yeah, but why do you have a dongle over your head? Okay, this way is out. This way is out. As you say. And we have to pass- Ooh, jeez. We have to pass the front door on the way to Dust Town anyway, so... Lord Haramont, furious at the Could step outside. Head to the camp. Three wardens endorse anarchy in Orzammar. Support Lord Haramont and his cavalry. Yeah, maybe Augur will talk to us now too. <laughs> Wait, did I give you the last nug I found? I trust Vala, my nug wrangling friend. He says there's more to find. But I don't know where they would be. Yeah, of here. course. Very well. Let me just run outside real quick. Ooh, stop doing that. I don't like that. Were you really in that cage for 20 days? It might have been closer to 30. I stopped counting after a while. What did you do? I mean, 20 days is a long time to sit in one place and do nothing. 
On good days, I posed riddles to the passers-by, offering them treasures in exchange for correct answers. Really? No. <laughs> oh, too bad. That's got serious potential. Red, please, sir. Uh, just for the love of paragons. I wish I could, but I can't interact with you. Alright. Now can we go to camp? Yes! Oh, ooh, oh. <laughs> All right, let's chat with everybody real quick. Here I am. Can I answer some questions? Oh, this should be good. Go ahead. Uh, what does it take to be an assassin? Well. The Crows would have you believe that it is an involved process that takes years of training. The sort that tests both your resolve and your endurance. Survive that process and maybe, just maybe, you're good enough to start being considered one of them. But quite frankly, the truth is that all it requires is a desire to kill people for a living. It's surprising how well one can do in such a field. Doesn't take any special skill? I don't know about that. It's simply a slightly different skill set from your average killer as I see it. An assassin simply specializes in striking from stealth and in maximizing that first attack to be as lethal as possible. Debilitate your foe, either by poison or by crippling their limbs, makes any follow-up combat you need to engage in that much simpler. That sounds like it could be useful. See? Getting paid for the act is beside the point. An assassin is more a tactical choice than a lifestyle. Of course, the crows like to pretend that their abilities are trade secrets, shrouded in shadows and wrapped in a blanket of mystery. So let's just keep this between you and me, shall we? Hmm? Yes? I'd like to talk. Well, here I am. Uh, no new topics. Wait, do I have like a... Yes? No, never mind. Something on your mind? I have some questions. Of course. Oh boy. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. If you were raised in the Chantry, have you never... Never... never what? Had a good pair of shoes? Sex? Oh, so that's what we're talking about. <laughs> well, if you really want to know, you tell me first. I'll tell you what, of course I have. And apparently you have no shame as well. <laughs> well, all right, I'll play along. I myself never had the pleasure. Not that I have <laughs> thought about it. Of course he needs to say it like that. But, you know. You know. <laughs> oh, I see, you lack the proper parts. Oh, that's funny. Your cruel japes will be remembered, sir. If you hear sobbing later, that's me crying myself to sleep. <laughs> At least you'll get some decent rest. Ha ha ha. Your cruel interrogation will be remembered forever. Or maybe just until lunch. Lunch makes everything better. Oh, look, I have cheese. <laughs> You called. I, I didn't. I just walked over and looked up at you because you're tall. Uh, I have a question. I am hardly surprised. Do you find Ferelden very strange? To put it lightly, no one has a place here. Your farmers wish to be merchants. The merchants dream of being nobles, and the nobles become warriors. No one is content to be who they are. Is there anything you like about Ferelden? There is... Interesting food here. You have a thing. It doesn't have a word in the Kunari tongue. Little baked things like bread, but sweet and crumbly. Cookies? Yes. We have no such things in our lands. This should be remedied. I'll keep that in mind. Shall we move on? Don't the Kunari ever want to change their lot in life? What does that accomplish? The farmer who buys a shop is never a merchant. He is always a farmer turned merchant. 
He carries his old life with him as a turtle carries its shell. But that makes the turtle stronger. Does it? It's also his weakness. If he stumbles and falls over, it pins him on his back. It is better to armor yourself with no more than what you need. One life, one duty. You don't think happiness is important? You can learn to find it in doing your duty, in serving your people. There is no need to search for it. Shall we move on? Let's go. As you wish. Oh, wow, he approved. A lot. I'm always really nervous as to how he'll react to the conversation. What do you wish of me? I'd like to ask you something. If you must. Never mind. What do you wish of me? I'd like to discuss something personal. We are in camp, so tis as good a time as any. Never mind. Already asked all that. You got mad at me last time I asked that, so I'm not gonna ask that again. Um, alright. Inventory shuffle. Let's give people some presents and then I'll sell a- er, no, I'll sell stuff and then I'll give people presents. If there's anything I can do for you, please, please tell me. Let me see your words. I'm sure you'll be pleased with the goods my boy and I have collected, and with your discount. All right, present time. A couple of these are for people we don't have yet, and a couple of these are for people we do have, but they're very specifically for things that they mention in conversation and stuff, so I'm not going to give it to them until they mention it. Some of these are just generic gifts we can give to people. Woo, look how much Sten likes us! That's so many! Dog likes us. Alright, Morgan we should probably get up. Interesting. Interesting. Just bestow jewelry upon her. There, sovereign. Is it twenty? I like myself just fine. Alistair's 32. Here, have a painted sky ball. Oh, thank you. That's very nice. Stan, you like paintings, right? I have a portrait of a goose girl. Unexpected. Thank you. Liliana, I could have gone some more than drastic. I... That's a wonderful thought. I don't know what to say. Oh, thank you. That's very nice. Alright, rinse Is that for me? Really? Wow! I'm... T wow! Alright, saving those. Here, you can have a gold angel as Why, well. thank you so much. Oh, somebody got something. Oh, Liliana likes me enough to have a skill. Minor cunning. Alright. Gift giving success. I'm going to save. And we've got a little bit of time left. Let's head back into Orzammar. As you say. See what we can find out about Jarvia's stuff. Um. Indeed. Yes. I'll yes. Go with them for. And here we are. Uh, 
Let's see if I... Ah! Hello? Yes. Corrupted the warden. Ah! for Aroma. Ooh, I'm gonna die. Oh, I died. <laughs> Alright, that's a lot of very heavily armored people. What do I have? Let's target some of the big ones. It's fine. Fight's over. I was awake the whole time. Ooh, a heavy dwarven helmet. How nice of them to give us that. I feel like one of our sword boys might like that. Or you're not strong enough to wear this hat. I'm sorry. <laughs> the Torvin stuff looks so cool. Yeah, three physical resistance. Actually, Liliana, do you have a hat? You have a hat. Oh yeah, these loading screws are effed up. Oh, hey everybody. There's a suspicious door over there. That's the slum's house. Didn't get enough of the architectural beauty of Dust Town? You need old Nadezda to play tour guide? Know anything about the Carta? Know it? I lived it, my friend. And let me tell you, it's worse now than in my day. Jarvia took over the Carta not more than a year ago, and already she's got every duster with both legs bearing swords for her. Does the Carta have a base anywhere? They do, but it's not easy to find. Jarvia's got real paranoid. She's got Carta members all carrying these finger bone tokens. She scratches some mark into them so she'll know they came from her. There's doors to her base all over the city, but only one is ever open at a time. And if you show up without a token, you'd never know it was there. Where do I find one of these tokens? Can't help you there, Selraka. The Carta members keep them real tight. But that's worth something, right? Maybe just a little. I'll give you ten silver. Take care of yourself. I'll think of you when I go to bed with a full stomach. Alright. We gotta find somebody with a finger bone. Well, ah. look what we have here. Jarvia said you were looking for trouble. That was Congratulations. Mess. You found it. Hey, do you have finger bones by any chance? I mean, I could take your finger bones. I don't know if they have special mark. Oh, yes. Oh, 
about to say, tight corners are really good for you on this stuff. I will not fall! Don't kill me! Sonny ancestors! What do they teach you on the surface? You fight like a bleeding archdemon. Sweet bloody stone, look at them all! Uh, tell me where your base is. The base is below the city. You, uh, you can get to it through the wall of the third house uh, on this road. Put this token house. through the slot, and it'll third open. Door. Suspicious uh, will you let me go now? Yes, and you won't want to be at Jarvia's when I get there. Really? Oh, thank you. You're a good person. How do they say it? The ancestors have shown their favor. Bless you. We found a finger bone. Oh, I forgot to fix my... Um... Oops. Forgot to fix my injury. So now I have... You have one. We're fine now. That's how injuries work. Small slot concealed in a fold of the stone, just big enough for a finger. Put finger bone token in the slot. Hello, I'm an elf. I'm here to fuck your shit up. Ew. Knock knock. What's the password? <laughs> uh oh. Jarvia sucks lizard eggs. Looks like we have a martyr, boys. Yes. Question is, do I go all the way through well. and have the confrontation with Jarvia today, or do I stop here and save that for next time? Hello, people. See you there. Hey, what if? Like this, and you shoot one of the barrels. Oh, I can't do that. My power is yours. Yes. Ooh. Oh. Yeah, I figured that was a trap. It's fine. Okay. Oh, I love backstabbing people. Go on. Step, step, step. Hi, I'm here to stab you. 
<laughs> All right. Oh, nice little house. Got some chests. Oh, god damn it. I could do that for you. No, you can't, you liar. Unless that doesn't connect in the back. Yeah, let's start here. Nope. See you. Hi. You shall not touch me. You are forced my hand. A bit more dying, please. Ah! A tush, Kunari! Oh. Let you grab some glory! Very well. Oh god, he's done me right before I drink. Oh good, it came out of me. Uh, oh, dwarven armor, eh? Hey Sten, you wanna, you wanna dwarven armor too? Go with your helmet? It's the last. Then the heavy chain mail. Hmm. Could get you a set bonus eventually. Actually. Let's just give the dwarven stuff to Alistair. I'll grow into that helmet. Very well. Uh, I don't remember which one is hers. Dog leveled up. No, nope, don't step on that. No. Oh, the dog triggered it, but he resisted it. Yes. Kiss Sue. Oh, is this like your armory? Got some sweet shit for me? Ooh, studded leather armor. Oh, 
Oh yeah, that's a bugger. Tier three later. Yes, please. I've heard much about the halls of the dwarven kings, but the stories do it no justice. I was actually it is so strange. trying to get to the, the dead Harsh, body behind you. Yet beautiful. Yes, it's very grand. And have you seen those tiny pig-like burrowing animals? They are adorable. I wish I could have one as a pet. Oh, you want to know? But they must be hard to catch and... Oh, just ignore me. I'm so silly sometimes. Let's just go. Well, if you want a nug, I can get you a nug. I'm the finest nug wrangler in these parts, you know. Alright, I'm gonna finish doing these houses, I think, that aren't connected to anything. Watch me open the one that is. Oh, that's a lot of stuff in the doorway. Um. It's only a purple shot, is it? Or pin shot. Try not to Hey, dog, you can, like, attack people, you know. <laughs> Let us end oh, this quickly! Oh, oh. oh Liliana leveled up. You force our hand. Let's make this quick. As Maybe now she can be better than me at opening locks. Oh, this is a big fancy door that goes further in. That's probably the way to go. Alright, I'm gonna level up Liliana and then I'm gonna call it here. And next time we'll continue our hunt for Jarvia. I feel like suppressing fire is gonna come in less handy for us actually. Alright, sorry, I'm getting way too into this. Uh, yeah, gotta save here. Then we're gonna call it. And we have one more death. One more taint, kind of, because I said taint, but it was just a bark because we saw Darkspawn. Um, I don't think I'm going to count it. Thanks for watching.